In this video, I'll show you the best free logo design software. If you're new to the channel, please go down below and consider subscribing. And once you've done that, please go down below and consider leaving a like and let's jump straight into this guide. So the first thing you need to do is go and open up a web browser and go to a search engine such as Google. The first software I'm going to show you is the Adobe Logo Maker. So type that in just like so, just as I'm typing in just now and make sure you scroll down and go to the free Logo Maker. Now, even though you know the website, do keep watching this guys. I'm gonna show you exactly how you can go and use it. So once you're on the website, then all you need to do is press on create your logo now. Now we need to go and tell Adobe about our logo. So I'm gonna go and fill this information in here. So in this case, I'm gonna do my YouTube business is called um, Guide Realm. And then you need to go and enter a slogan, which is optional. So personally, I'm gonna go and skip that there. Then as you can see, you can now go and choose a style. You've got bold, elegant, modern, and decorative as well. So in this case, I'm gonna go for modern actually, and then go and press next and then we can actually go and choose an icon. So as you can see, um, it says icon, icons can help add personality. You can go and search for a keyword as well. As you can see in this case, I've got a lot of YouTube related stuff as that's why I entered in sort of the start of this, of this form here. So I'm gonna go and use this one here. So I'm gonna tap on it just like that and then go and press next. Now it's going and designing logos for you. It's honestly that quick. And it's gonna go and give you a ton of variants as you know, obviously everyone's got different ideas of how they want things to look. And then you can literally scroll down um, and it's gonna keep generating more for you as you scroll down. And it's important to know that all of these logos can also be customized. So if you see something you like the look of, then all you need to do is hover your mouse over it and then you can go and tap customize. Um, and then you can go and start making further edits with the color, the text um, and a few other aspects as well. So just because you don't like the color or something that doesn't mean you shouldn't go for it um, because you can still go and edit it loads. So for example, I could go and change the color to more of a blue or a green. And when you tap on it, it's going to go and give you different variants. And then when you want to go and download it, all you need to do is sign in to download. So press here. I'm going to quickly sign into my Adobe account and then I'll download it. The next logo design software I want to show you is by Wix. So it's called the Wix logo design software. So type that in just like so, Wix logo maker. Then what you want to do is scroll down and here it is here, logo maker. So go and tap on it just like so. And then once you're on the website, all you need to do is press start now and then we can go and start desi designing our logo. So as you can see here, we've got this left and right option. So you can either go and create a logo yourself or hire a professional designer. So in this case, we're gonna go and create our own one. So press create a logo just like this. So once you've signed up for an account, the first thing you need to do is go and enter your name. So once again, I'm gonna go enter my name, which is guide realm, just like so, and then go and press let's go. Then you need to go and add what your logo is for. So I guess I'll do like YouTube profile picture or something like that. Here it is YouTube site. So I'll press there and then go and press next. Then you want to go and choose how you want your logo to look and feel. So we've got dynamic, fun, playful, modern. So I guess I want mine to be dynamic, modern, uh, fresh, um, techie, formal. You can add a few others as well. And then as you can see, we can now go and start choosing what type of thing we prefer, um, just so it's gonna help Wix get, get an idea of what type of thing we like. So I quite like this one on the right actually. Um, and then I'm gonna go for this one here and then this one here. And then it's gonna go and analyze your answers and find your style. And here we are, so now you can go and choose your logo and then we go and customize it. So just like the Adobe one, you sort of find the basic one you like and then we can go and make further changes to it uh, to really sort of polish it off and go and get what we like. So scroll down this list here and see if you find something you like the look of. So in this case here, I like the look of this one. I'm not a fan of the green, so I'm definitely gonna go and customize it. So tap on it and then you can go and press customize your logo. Then what we can go and do is, is go and change the color. So as you can see, go and choose a beautiful color combination for your logo. So in this case, let's just try this top one here, see what it looks like. That definitely looks quite cool. This beach bonfire looks quite interesting. Um, that definitely sort of matches the colors I like. And there's baby flamingo as well. But I think the beach bonfire definitely does win for me. So then I'm gonna go and tap on next, just like so in the top right and wait for it to load. And then it's gonna go um, and try and offer you a website. But in this case, I just need a logo for now. So I'll tap there at the bottom. And then Wix offering some plans, but if you scroll to the bottom, you can just go and try out your logo by pressing download a free sample and your sample will download. And then we can go and open it up uh, just like so. And then here it is, here is our logo and it's that easy guys. 